Well, hello there. I'm Pete LaFrance, the old growler. This is Meeting Expectations. What we do is we take a look at a can of beer, bottle of beer. Sometimes a spirit might drop by. We're all friends in fermentation. We read what's on the label, what they're trying to sell us. We take a look at the artwork and we crack it open and see if it meets expectations. All right. This time I'm from the Concord Craft Brewing Company up in Concord, New Hampshire. Just got back for a couple days ago from Concord. And uh, this is their Safe Space New England India Pale Ale. And it says, okay, by readers' picks of the something of voted best of the New Hampshire made beer. Please recycle. Oh wow, they got a little whole story here. Our, our safe space New England uh, India Pale Ale is so big in flavor and soft in finish, its tasteness is something that can bring all of us together. It has an intense, a complex citrusy aroma from liberal dry hopping and late addition hops. It has a light hazy yellow hue and a full mouthfeel bursting with tropical fruit. Despite a rich, full flavor profile, this beer refreshes, refreshes clean and is refreshing. It is so smooth and delicious, it will bring you to your safe space. Feel free to share the love. Life is too short for uninspired beer. Live free or die. Wow. That's a lot of information. Doesn't tell me anything about the beer, though. Let's take a look over here. Brewed and canned by Concord Craft Brewing Company, Concord, New Hampshire, and under special arrangement agreement, Framingham, Massachusetts. Okay, beer is perishable. Please keep this beer refrigerated. Please recycle. Oh, come on. Okay, we got alcohol, 6.0 6 by volume. Uh, and that's about it. I'll, I will um, transcribe this uh, down into the description box below. And... Uh, it has all kinds of, let's see, um, the Independent Brewing uh, uh, Association, of, that it's an independent brewer. They've got their symbols for Facebook and Twitter and all that kind of good stuff. Uh, all right. They just told me it's a hazy, um, yellow-hued, uh, mouthful of uh, kind of tropical fruits. It's a... That's what I'm looking for. All right, let's crack it open and see if it meets those expectations. By the way, it comes in at four dollars a uh, four dollars a can. I will give the address and the um, all of the information on where I got this down in the description box. Here we go. You'll notice we use the same glass for all of our beer tastings. That way nobody has a leg up when it comes to being able to get the clarity or the aromatics. Whoa, that was a miss. Well, it certainly looks like a New England India Pale Ale. And it is, it's got that kind of a yellow haze to it. That's, that's nice. And it's, it's throwing a very good head. Very good. Okay, well, most people, when they do their tastings, they take, a, they take a look, they sniff, they sip, and then they let you know what they think. Well, I do it a little bit differently. What I do is I take a look, I sip first, and then sniff. Why? I'll let Master Sommelier Fred Dex explain it all to you. He can do it a lot better than I can. Okay, well, all beer should be served at this right temperature. Ales at around, oh, say, 50 to 55 degrees Fahrenheit and lagers of 37 to 47 degrees Fahrenheit. There's a link right up there to let you know what temperature your beer should be served at. I have folks at Thermalink sent me this lollipop thermometer and I am going to use it to find out that our India Pale Ale is at 46 degrees Fahrenheit, which is just about right for sampling an ale. Well, it looks like a New England India Pale Ale. Let's see if it tastes like one. Cheers.
You'll notice I took two sips. The reason for that is that the first sip is an acclimation sip. The taste buds weren't paying attention to me and they weren't ready for anything and all of a sudden they get this cool liquid with all kinds of good flavors and they, they, they weren't ready. So I had to give them a second chance and I'm going to give them a third. It has a, a great, it's full body, that's for sure. It's a very lush feeling in the mouth. The hops, they really develop. It starts out where there's not too much there. It's just kind of a grainy, uh, nice, cool, grainy flavor. And then the hops start to develop and they are still developing. This is, a, this is some beers are five second beers. It takes, it takes five seconds for your brain to figure out what uh, it smells and tastes like. Well, this is a 15 second beer, that's for sure. All right, well, the first nosedive. Well, yeah, there's, there's just as much of the, of the hop, um, particularly a, a piney, a citrusy thing that blends in with the um, uh, hop uh, oils that create those wonderful, lush, uh, tropical fruit flavors. It matches up perfectly. Well, it does. Safe Space, New England India Pale Ale by the Concord Craft Brewing Company and Concord, New Hampshire meet expectations? It certainly does. If you enjoyed this presentation, please click on the subscribe button and the bell. That way you won't miss any of our presentations. A thumbs up would be great and a comment would really be appreciated. I'm Pete LaFrance, the Old Growler, hoping all of your beers meet expectations.